Let me see. And if anybody else has any, you know, our stories, uh, watch it. Remember, I have stories about this longer than her. She has a camera yet. Oh, oh. But I'm sure you have some far stories. Nothing that should be discussed in the company. Marm has a reputation, as we probably know. and for all the people that I've met since then. Um, in 97, we've all been through a lot together. A lot in life, a lot here at the mill. Um, it's been a wild ride. It hasn't always been fun. But it's always there's always been a certain amount of reward and just you know, self-pride in what we did here. And I just want to, I hope you all continue this legacy for years to come. If I was younger, I would still, I'd be sticking around, but I'm not going to be here in, in my 80s. I'm not playing that game. <laughs> <laughs> so, for everybody I've known forever, I love you guys. We, we have a work family. For those that I've just met recently, that, you know, you're all part of it. You're all part of my heart. So. Thank you. Thank you. I 
you go to the machine floor, the schedule is so crazy that you just you're just convinced that eventually you're going to mess it up and show up on the day when you're not supposed to work or not show up on a day when you are supposed to work. And the only time in 20 years of working with a that I messed that up was I forgot to mess with my own alarm clock and I'd show up an hour early. So I'd get halfway down the freeway going, man, there's hardly anybody on the road. Until it finally dawns on me that I'm coming in an hour early. So I call Barb and say, hey, you want to get off work? Or do you want me to go to breakfast? It's your choice. Well, usually she just say, well, come on and I'll go home. <laughs> That's about it. <laughs> 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 <laughs>